it is important because um, if you work in the vertical, um, um, sorry, I should start by saying that um, when you work with your navigation system, you're going to um, work in diastole in the in the chamber of interest. So if you work in the vertical, you're going to have your anatomy um, that is acquired in diastole, so the biggest volume. And um, if you want uh, that to match with the uh, images that are reconstructed, then it means that those images have to be acquired at the same time of the cardiac cycles, so uh, in diastole. And um, the importance is that if you try to register the uh, model of your patient that is reconstructed from MR or CD, and that has been acquired during end diastole. If you want to do the registration process using the atria, then it doesn't work because uh, the atria in your navigation systems uh, system are going to be mapped in uh, diastole of the atria, which means systole in the ventricles. So it's a mismatch, and and um, this this simply doesn't work. So it's really important to realize that. And if you want to work in the atria then you have to specify that your, your uh, uh, CT scan or MR has to be made in diastole of the atria and not in diastole of the ventricles. That's very important. And it also explained the um, strategy for the registration, but I, I think we'll see that later.